already stressing out about this video. Hello, 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 everybody. Welcome to the channel. My name is Lindsay, and this is Life with Lindsay. This has been a super, super highly requested video. Um, I'm going to say this now. This entire canvas will not fit on my table. I am filming it sideways and standing at a super awkward angle. So if you guys see, like, my floor over here, you know, tell me a little <laughs> Anyway, before I get into it, a few boring housekeeping tips. If you hear a noise directly this way, I have a fan running because I can't keep it over here because there's not enough room. I am filming this while my tiny human is sleeping, but hopefully we don't hear any of those noises. And I am filming this while my husband is in the room, so you will definitely hear husband noises. Say hi, husband. Hello. All right, so I'm not sure what this dark... Oh, that's probably from my recording arm. Anyway, this video has been highly requested, and... If, oh, God, I just dropped a bunch of stuff on the floor, you guys. We're going to just pretend that that didn't happen. So, what we have here is the old shoe house. This is a square kit from Diamond Art Club by Dominic Davison. And I will leave everything down below. If I ever miss something, or I don't put something in when I say I'm going to, or the link doesn't work, please just kindly let me know, either in the comments or shoot me a DM on Instagram. All of my information is linked down below. Anyway, so this is a 105 by 70 centimeter, 57 colors, including 3AB kit, square kit from Diamond Art Club. So this took me a total of 38 days for a total of 102 hours and 44 minutes. Now, if you're ever wondering why I use a timer, that's why. Part of it is to let me know how long I'm working, but also to remind me to get up and move. So, all right, let's just look at the canvas first. Um, this has so much sparkle on it. It's this. Okay. So, if you have been following along long enough, you're probably a bit surprised that this stylistically is something that I chose to do. Um, so am I. <laughs> After watching everybody do the chuck along, um, whenever that was, fall, I don't know. I decided I was very interested in getting a scenery-based canvas. This one came up for sale. I snagged it right away. At the time of this filming, I believe this is out of stock. I will link it down below, but make sure you just sign up for those email alerts. They do let you know when they come back in stock. Because of the size of this canvas, um, I had to work on it completely sideways. So I started down at, well, you'll see it, down this corner, and then I worked my way up this way. Flipped the canvas, started, I want to say that corner, and worked my way to the middle. Um, the detail in this is unbelievable. Unbelievable. Uh, if I didn't know any better, I would think this was an oil painting that just had beautiful shimmer to it. So, let's... You can see all the little details here. There's a canoe here. There's the old shoe house. It has the... Flower bed in the window, the cherry blossoms up in the corner. I mean, look at that sparkle. This is unbelievable. And I, I'm not just saying it to be like, oh my god, this kit was amazing. This kit was unbelievable. I, the burnout is real. If you guys have ever worked on a large kit or a canvas for a really long time, you know how exhausting it can be. This canvas, and I said this to my husband, I felt like every time I worked on this, I worked on something that was different than the day before and the day behind me, or the day after me. I love this canvas. I absolutely, there's nothing I can say in terms of this image. So, up here you have the cherry blossoms with the rainbow leading into the mountain with the castle. Ooh, get my belly out of that. Then this is the corner that I started on down here with all of the mushrooms and the flowers. I mean, this is, when I tell you guys this canvas was a joy to work on, I, I, there's nothing else I can say about it. Um, I, are you guys those people like me who every single time you're working on something, you go, oh my God, I'm not going to have enough drills. I can't tell you how many times I said that in this canvas. I never came close to running out. Not once. I don't know why I was so nervous. I will say 
here are, oops, don't mind the ring light reflecting there. Here are all the drills that I use. You can see there's a ton. Um, like this one here came a little low, but I mean, there's more than enough there that I didn't have to worry. Um, I did have one issue and it's not really an issue because Diamond Art Club resolved it right away for me. I believe a, a bunch of other people had the same issue that I did. There was a misprint and I will show you guys what that was. Okay. So the lighting in here is terrible. So I do apologize. It's going to be very difficult to see what I'm trying to show you. But just trust me on this. <laughs> Let me deal with this. So, these are the same colors. This is labeled 985. This is labeled 895. 985 is not an existing DMC color. Now, if you're watching this in the future, for all I know, they could have added it. But as of right now, this is not... An existing color. Um, I don't know what is happening to my screen, so I tapped something, so now things are blurry. Ugh. Ever do that? Oh, now it went away. So anyway, nine eighty-five. So I got a bunch of these, and I got none that were labeled eight ninety-five. Now I'm ninety-nine point nine percent sure that these are the same color, and I didn't want to. Potentially be placing the wrong color all over my canvas. Uh, you will take notice. This canvas had at any given time one, two, three, four, five of the darker gray or green shades. There's a couple light green shades. There's a light green AB. So I didn't want to put the wrong color down. All I did was contact Diamond Art Club. I let them know what my experience was and they sent me out free of charge as they do because there's a guarantee on your canvas now as far as i know and I, I might be wrong things might change in the future this kit is not available in stores if you did not know diamond art club does sell some of their kits at hobby lobby and joanne fabrics uh if anywhere else just leave it down below um those kits do come with a guarantee the same way these kits do but you have to actually mail something in or register your canvas. If you did not know, Diamond Art Club has an oops guarantee. So if you drop, spill, lose, mix up your colors, they will replace them um, and they will make it right. So they sent me over, I want to say it was two or three bags. I think it was three of the smaller bags. And then instead of the, I think there were two of, I don't remember. Um, because I kept asking them, well, how many are in this kit? Because it, I might be able to swing it. And anyway, long story short, they sent me the replacement drills. I've been hanging on to this for so long so that I could show you guys. Um, I had zero issues in terms of popping drills. I had zero issues in terms of adhesive problems. Um, I had a little bit of trash, but nothing out of the ordinary. This kit uh this crept its way into my top three for the year so bayou lady all three of them are actually diamond art club bayou lady which is the tiana um which if you see on uh diamond art club's website anything that says coming soon that means that it will be restocked if you see final edition that means once they sell out it's gone so, uh, Bayou Lady, if you have any interest in getting her, uh, snag her before she is gone because she is on that list for the final edition. Um, so anyway, Bayou Lady, my Alice in Wonderland kit from JoJo's Art, and this one. I, I cannot speak highly enough on this canvas. I mean, this shine, and if I tell you guys my lighting in here is horrible, you obviously saw and heard me say I have a ring light, but my overhead light is off. And the lights in this room, there's one other light. It's like yellow. It's crappy. It is what it is. That's not the point. <laughs> it's not the point of this video. Um, but you can see this isn't because there's extra light shining on it. It is just that sparkly. If I can figure out where to put this and how to frame it, because this is a big canvas. Um, 
there was never any question while I was working on it what I was working on. Um, you take a step away, you can see exactly what it is. I love this kit. I love this kit. This was top-notch. This is the kind of kit that you expect from Diamond Art Club or one of these higher-end companies. The quality was fantastic. The customer service was fantastic. The rendering on this is unbelievable. I mean, while I was doing the little trees here... I felt like Bob Ross. If you guys don't know who Bob Ross is, I'll insert a picture here. But he used to do um, happy trees that he would paint on PBS. And my dad used to tape. This is really aging myself. My dad used to tape his segments off of PBS and play them back on VCR and try to learn how to paint his happy little trees. And that's what this reminds me of. I mean, the sparkle on the ABs are gorgeous. I mean, you've got... The cherry blossoms. Let's see if I can get the little bird in. You got the little bird. I mean, the geese here. The geese I didn't realize were there until I took a step back. When I put this one down on the floor when it was done to take a photo, it blew my mind. Um, I am sorry that I can't fit it all in frame at the same time, but I hope that this does give you a good idea of what the canvas looks like. I'm trying to zoom you guys up a little bit. Um, I know there were some people out there who were probably tired of seeing me watch work on this canvas because it did take me, um, what did I say, 38 days? If I'm wrong, editing Lindsay will just correct on the screen. But this canvas was stunning. I, 10 out of 10, I would do this canvas again. Um, so if you guys have any questions, um, on this canvas or any other canvases that I've worked on, please leave them down below. Or send me a direct message on Instagram. I do have my Instagram and my Facebook group linked down below at all times. <sighs> I, I love this kit, you guys. I mean, look at these mushrooms. I mean, this is so realistic. This is probably the most realistic canvas that I've done to date. Um, I have others that are unbelievable. I like to do a lot of character. Your Hannah Lynn's, your Mandy Manzano's, that kind of stuff. Nico Jolina. I, I love this. <laughs> really can't say anything else so i'm gonna wrap this one up here so that i don't just keep rambling here for the rambles if you guys like this video please give it two thumbs up one real life one virtual make sure you subscribe to the channel come join the sparkle squad and make sure oh i just hit something hopefully that didn't come up across the screen um i don't even know where i was going Two thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel. Make sure you hit that notification bell. Ding. There we go. I do not upload on any sort of schedule. I operate on toddler standard time, so I record while she is sleeping or sleeping. I apologize for banging into the camera. I'm at a totally different setup than my normal setup, which is different than my good setup. Anyway, nobody cares about that. I'm going to get going before I keep rambling. Thank you guys so much for being here, and I'll see you on my next one. Bye, guys. <laughs>